Hello friends, welcome back. My name is PK. In this video, I will show you how we have created this employee turnover dashboard in Microsoft Power BI. As you are seeing my screen, this is the Microsoft Power BI desktop version. And here we are showing this employee turnover dashboard. We have created this dashboard with five different pages. The first page is the overview page. And here on the top, we have put the various slicer like status, location, department you can select any department then accordingly whole page will be filtered or if you want to see gender wise information you can see the gender wise also then you can see the age band wise also like less than 25 years 25 to 34 34 35 to 44 and some other and you can select the date range also and then accordingly you can see that now here we are showing the active headcount first, then terminated headcount, then this is resign count, terminated plus resign combined and total turnover percentage. This is on the basis of some dummy data, it is not the actual data. Then here we are showing the headcount by region of for exit. So we can see maximum is for the career change, then better opportunity, personal region and some others. We are showing here total headcount by status and this is the resign percentage this is total turnover this is the resign percentage the active headcount by the location okay we have given here on the left hand side page navigation also if you want to jump to the another page you can just click on this so it will take you to the another page or at bottom you can see the pages also now this is the exit insights so here again we are showing the same slicer then this is the resign by the month of exit and we are showing here reason for exit the uh, distribution and the contribution percent is also so maximum is for this career change which is approximately 20 percent people are leaving just because of the career change then here we have the terminated plus resign percentage by the age band maximum um, coming in between this and resign percentage by the department now we can see the departmental turnover also so just click here and it has taken us to the departmental turnover page we have the same slicers here then we are showing the turnover percentage by the department in the marketing we have the highest which is 48 percent followed by the it now here we are showing the active headcount by the department and this is the resign count by the department terminated percentage by the department and we are showing the headcount versus terminated percentage okay on this chart so you can just take the mouse also you can see this is the marketing we have the total head count 77 and 10 uh, percent terminated and here maximum is this and we have the highest head count also now we have given the gender wise analysis also and we are showing here resign percentage by gender and the age band so we are showing here resign percentage and we are showing here total head count and then we are showing here gender wise and if you take the mouse you can see the age band also now we are showing here terminated percent terminated plus resign count by the gender also so maximum is for the female you can see and that is 126 approximately 62 percent contribution active head count by the gender you can see it so maximum we have for the female almost 64 percent we have created here a small table also to see the more detail you can put this in the focus mode also so that you can see that now the last one is the joining and exit trend just click here so we are seeing here terminated count by the year of exit and here we are showing the resign count by the year of exit you can drill down this as per your requirement for example i want to see this year 2024 so just click here and then you can just click here so now we see month on month information for 2024 if i click again let's say on feb okay you can click on drill up to see that again so now this is all in this dashboard and i will show you the all majors data model and the data also the data is available in Microsoft Excel. We have created this Excel file wherein we are taking the employee ID, employee name, gender, department, location, age when, joining date, status, exit date, reason for exit, tenure, and then year of exit and month of exit. Now let me come here and let me show the data. So this is the data you can see. 
we have the simple data we just have loaded this there is no cleaning step in the power query then in the data model we haven't taken any other table we are just using this table and now let me show you the measures also so here we have created the measures for total head count that is the active head count plus terminated plus resigned count that is total head count and then uh, let me show you the terminated count so we have used the count rows then filter and status equal to terminated similarly for the terminated plus resign we have taken this formula wherein status is terminated or status is resigned resign count similar to the terminated count once we have created and the active count is status is active okay once we have created this then we just have created some percentage also using the divide function resign divided by total head count then here terminated terminated count divided by total head count so this is the total head count okay so that is how we have created these all measures once all the measures are created then we have created this beautiful design this design we have created in the powerpoint once we created this in the powerpoint then we have just placed the chart here and in the powerpoint you can just save that uh, picture somewhere in the folder as jpg or png image then from the formatting here in the canvas background you can just load that image and just select here fit and take the transparency zero then that will appear on your dashboard all right friends so that is how we have created this friends i hope you have enjoyed this video if you like this video please hit the like button and please subscribe my channel to get the regular update of my videos thank you so much for the watching